Welcome! The following video will demonstrate how to insert and replace the batteries for a 2 gig wireless smoke heat and freeze alarm. Begin by twisting the alarm counterclockwise to remove the alarm from its mounting base. Then remove and dispose of the batteries according to your local regulations. You will then need to wait a minimum of 20 seconds before inserting new batteries to ensure a proper power down sequence. Insert three AAA Energizer E92 batteries into the battery compartment. You will want to follow the polarity diagram inside the compartment. Note, if the batteries are not inserted correctly, the alarm will not operate and the batteries may be damaged. If you accidentally insert the batteries incorrectly, use a non-conductive tool to gently remove them and then correctly reinsert the batteries. Warning. Failure to follow these warnings and instructions can lead to heat generation, rupture, leakage, explosion, fire, or other injury or damage. Do not insert the battery into the compartment in the wrong direction. Always replace the battery with the same or equivalent type. Never recharge or disassemble the battery. Never place the battery in fire or water. Always keep batteries away from small children, and if batteries are swallowed, promptly see a doctor. Reattach the alarm to the mounting base by turning the alarm clockwise until the marks align. Then wait for the power-up sequence to complete. Once the power-up sequence completes, you'll see the green LED light blink about once every 12 seconds to indicate normal operation. Note, if the alarm does not power up, make sure the batteries are fully charged and correctly inserted. The 2 gig wireless smoke heat and freeze alarm batteries have now been replaced. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube page and click the show more tab underneath the video where you can view valuable links pertaining to this product, similar how to videos, and our low cost, no contract alarm monitoring services.